Today I want to talk about a game that truly captures what the future of Roblox will look like. This is a game called Pocket Anime. And if you spend any time on the Roblox Discovery page, you'll notice a lot of popular games there involve collecting and placing down anime characters to make them work for you. Games like All Star, Tower Defense, and Anime Adventures fall into this category. Now don't get me wrong, these games can be really fun to play, but in my opinion no one has mastered this formula yet. And that's where Pocket Anime comes in. Pocket Anime combines the elements of games like All-Star Tower Defense with an exploration aspect we really haven't seen in this type of game before. In games like Anime Adventures, you could teleport to different maps, but it doesn't really feel like true exploration. You're really just transported from one anime-themed area to another anime-themed area. But Pocket Anime, on the other hand, allows you to roam a beautiful open world as you level up. It's a lot more satisfying to travel through a new world and see all the unique things it has to offer while still being able to recognize elements from your favorite anime shows. I think Pocket Anime has the potential to appeal to both the simulator crowd and the anime community on Roblox, and it's set to release in 2023, and I believe it could become one of the top 5 games on the platform easily. In fact, I think we'll start to see a lot more games with this style after Pocket Anime's success, assuming it succeeds, but I really believe it will. And we know this will happen if it does succeed too, because it happens with all type of anime games. Look at like One Piece. The format naturally worked on Roblox, leading to the first One Piece games having success, and now there's about 7 million different One Piece games on Roblox. But even earlier I was talking about All-Star Tower Defense, who had a similar thing, leading to the creation of anime adventures and more games like it, basically creating its own genre on Roblox, and I genuinely believe Pocket Anime will have a level of success even higher than All-Star Tower Defense did, and I believe this will create a ton of games like it. With all that being said though, the most important thing is that Pocket Anime is actually fun to play. We don't completely know yet, we can only speculate, but I guess we'll find out. Um, but we just don't want to see a bunch of clones of a game that's not enjoyable, so that's why that's the most important thing. But that's just me. What do y'all think? If y'all enjoyed this video, I make content like this every damn day. So I would appreciate it if y'all would subscribe. Thank y'all.